Osceola County residents are raising concerns right now about the county roads, schools, and fire stations not being able to quite keep up with the rapid population growth. As West News Mega Mulatto explains, the county has plans for more fire stations, but right now there's only 15. That's the same number there were decades ago. Data from the U.S. Census Bureau shows Osceola County has grown by about 140,000 people in the last decade. It's expected to grow even faster in the next 10 years. The rapid growth has some residents who have spoken up at county commission meetings worried. This is not in the well-being of our district as our current roads to move traffic are already at a standstill, let alone our fire stations are overworked and our response time are well above national average already and imagine adding more residents. We looked into the response times across Central Florida. Osceola County says their average response time is 8 minutes and 30 seconds. Orange County says they're seeing 7 minutes and 33 seconds. Seminole County reported 5 minutes and 12 seconds. All three say the times differ per location. President of the Osceola County Firefighters Association, Sean Perkins, says in some areas of Osceola, response times can be as long as 25 minutes. Well, we have a specific rescue at 53 in Deer Run that covers stations 51, 52, 53, and parts of 54. So sometimes their response times can be as long as 17 to 20 minutes. Um, if they're not in quarters, if they're out running another call, and we have to call for mutual aid help from a different station, you could look at 25-minute response times to that particular area. <laughs> He credits the county for figuring out where stations are needed, but says they need them now. Right now, we could use at least five stations opening tomorrow, each one that would have its own engine and rescue, but it's just not in the budget. County leaders say they've seen a 69% increase in call volume since 2010. They say they have two fire stations under construction, which would take the total count from 15 to 17. They say they have a comprehensive plan through 2040 to extinguish the issue. In Osceola County, Megan Mulatto, West News.